we actually have a group of moms here. They're celebrating the stance that Dr. Gupta just talked about because they believe medical marijuana has a purpose, but what they say it does for them is going to shock you. Hi, my name is Cheryl, and this is my daughter, Amy. And one of the things that we really love to do is throw dinner parties for our friends. We love to cook together and have fun together. Our dinner parties are much like any other lavish dinner party in Beverly Hills, only we like to throw them with a little bit of a twist. At our dinner parties, what's different is we do cannabis tastings. Amy and I started together the Beverly Hills Cannabis Club for other moms. Everyone uh, that attends my parties, they are legal cannabis patients, so all of the food is infused with cannabis. The secret little ingredient is medicated olive oil. Okay, everybody, we're ready to eat. Mostly women come to our parties who are moms. Uh, I really empower women to come out of the closet and speak openly about their cannabis use and quite frankly how it makes them better moms. In 1996, I was prescribed antidepressants, anti-anxiety. They gave me a pill to go to sleep, a pill to wake up, and honestly, I'd become a zombie. I, I lost my desire to even get out of bed and, and the quality of life for my children was horrible. Then I tried cannabis and within literally two puffs, you remember this? I do. It was literally, I was smiling and laughing for the first time in almost a year. As soon as she started cannabis therapy, we had our mom back. Does it make you a better mom or? I think it makes me a better mom from the, from the standpoint that I, I use it for my insomnia and a well-rested mom is a happy mom, right? I have a 10-year-old daughter. When I talk to my daughter about cannabis, I equate it to the use of a prescription drug. And if used accurately, it can be a very good benefit for lots of different ailments. My goal for these parties is I want to encourage other moms and daughters all across the country to be open about what works for them, which is cannabis. And I'm proud that Amy and I are out there leading the way with our little pop parties. We're now joined by members of the Cannabis Club of Beverly Hills, Cheryl, Nicole, and Lynn, supported by Amy, Dana, Candace, Diane, and Tanya, who are back in our lounge. I want to thank you all for joining us and discussing uh, marijuana use. I think what you all are doing is, is a little bit different than what we just discussed with Dr. Gupta. Yeah. Um, because uh, I could not help but watch that and think, no one would get in a room with 20 people and take prescription drugs. You're like, so you quit. That's my only thing is that you say, okay, I equate it to a prescription drug, but no one would get in a room with 20 people and have a party let's and take say, our Prozac all right, let's serve one, two, three, take a pill. Pop so that's Prozac, the one thing that yeah. struck me watching that is, is how do you, if it helps you all as individuals, the sort of the party, the party aspect, um, I, that that sort of delivery system. It's very simple. Um, one of the reasons we have these parties is the biggest problem that I had when I was going through my illness is the lack of community and depression. I was suicidal. So for me to be able to celebrate life with my women friends who are out there changing the world and overturning and changing laws, that is something to be celebrated. And I do think it's important to note that there are cannabinoids out there that you can use for different purposes without that psychotropic effect. Um, that's what I use. So I don't have the high feeling sure. that people talk about a lot, which is the THC. And the hope here would be that we can do more and more research to figure out what cannabinoids have true medicinal purposes. Mm -hmm. exactly. And you'll start to think of it more as true treatment and the, the psychoactive element that everyone is just so associated with. You know, kind of take that out of the equation. It it's truly becomes a medicine yes. that has positive effects. It's, it's being used in the right way. It really is about education, and we're learning more and more about the true medicinal benefits of marijuana. Ladies, thank you so much.